Good day. So today we're going to talk about AZ900 or Azure Fundamentals, as some people will know. And specifically, how hard is AZ900? And I'm going to walk you through the what skills are measured against for the certificate and basically talk to you about Wiz Labs and show you like a, you know, a sample or just, you know, some sort of sample of the, the type of question that you may, you may come across. So let's cut to it. Is AZ900 difficult? No, it's easy. It's the easiest exam that you probably do in your whole career, in my humble opinion. Reason being is because it, if you've been in, in the trade for six months, if you've, if you've been in IT for more than six years, you will know some of the concepts that are there, that are there um, being questioned. Now, let's pretend that you haven't been there for six months. Let's pretend that you haven't been in IT trade for six years. That's okay because the quality of training that you get, online training from Microsoft, rest assured in about four weeks, five weeks of just doing the training, you should be able, you will pass actually. Not, not what you should, you will, you will pass. Take it from me, Jude the dude. So let's cut to it, right? Let's, let, let me just show you. So if I go in any decent search, if you punch in AZ900, okay, here's the book and stuff like that. Do I recommend getting the book? I don't recommend getting the book. I tell you why, because this industry changes. You know how many times I've actually purchased these books? I know I'm going off one, but within six months, it's just redundant or obsolete because the information has changed. Anyway, type in AZ900, punch that, hit, click that link, the official Microsoft, you'll get this. Here are the skills measured, really easy. Describe cloud concepts like HA fault tolerance. Describe core Azure services. Now, this is really important. I'll tell you why that's important. If you are from a on-premises, if you are from a Google or AWS cloud or Alibaba, and you try to think that the core concepts or the services or anything of the sort is similar or the same to, to Azure, it's not. Don't, please. The amount of times I've actually seen people who from AWS Google background who go and do a design or implementation for, for Azure and get it wrong. Not because Azure is wrong or Azure is difficult, it's because it's different. And you need to learn the different terminologies, concepts, regions, pricing, you know, that Azure has. So come in this with a blank slate, you know, come in it like a child willing to learn because you need to learn its different concepts. Not difficult, not by, not by miles, but it will help you. Describe core solutions, management tools in Azure, describe general security. So let's, 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 instead of just reading the high levels here, let's just cut to it and just see what it's like. Uh, cloud concepts, identify clouds such as high availability, CapEx, OpEx, you know, all these things, just learn them. It's really, really simple. Um, describe differences between types of cloud computing, define cloud computing, public cloud, private cloud, hybrid cloud, you know, come on really basic you'll be able to pass this exam so easy okay there's some different things that we need to try and understand reason regions or region pairs uh, google cloud aws but the same availability zones aws had this first but you know it could be different within azure resource groups no brand of subscriptions management groups azures yada yeah, yeah it's all here it's all really quite simple so this is probably the only difference. Describe Azure management tools. Okay, the Azure Advisor, the PowerShell, Azure CLI, Cloud Shell, mobile app. These are things that you would need to learn that may be different from the other vendors. And that's, you know, just keep scrolling down. So just, just, just friggin' do it. You know, give yourself like a month, two months, go through, I will say, here's your way, two ways to prepare online learning the path. So I've done my cert in 2019 and I did all the online and it, this was all 100% completed. As you can see here, 52% and this is completed, but a lot of things have changed. You know, and this is why I will always recommend to someone to do the online training in Microsoft as a way of measuring if something has changed or not. Okay. 
So let's get on to WizLabs and see a, just dig my nose there on camera. And let's see when you get my age, you got hair spouting about. <laughs> and let's, let's sample a free test question, okay? So let's read it together. A company has just set up an Azure virtual private connection between its on-premises network and Azure virtual network. Would the company need to pay additional costs to transfer several gigabytes of data from their on-premises network to Azure? Yes or no? So I think no. And the reason being is because I've done it several times. Let's see, it's no. And the good thing about WizLabs is that it, it, you know, they show you why that question is right or wrong, however selected. And uh, here's an official Microsoft document that just basically goes through bandwidth and it, it, it teaches you. And the reason why I show you this, especially with Labs, is because there's so many people out there who just brain dump, it's wrong, okay? Don't do dumps. Don't do, just remember um, the questions and select the answers and stuff like that because it will not add value to you. It will not add value to your career. It will not add value to anything. It will rob you. The reason why I say that is because I've did it in the beginning of my career and it is wrong. And I did it because everybody else was doing it and I had to compete. Don't do that. So there you go. So in this video, I covered off. If AZ900 is difficult, you can rest assured it's not. Just study, just use the online free material from Microsoft. I have covered the what was covered in the syllabus. I have also covered what you can expect from a type of question from showing you an example on Wiz Labs. And more importantly is rest assured, if you just do the work and if you just apply yourself, I can feel more than confident that you will pass. Anyway, thanks for watching. Do the dude out, start the day, gotta go to, go to work. <laughs>